Hi, and welcome to another quick tech review. This time about the PXN V900 steering wheel for PC and pretty much all of the things. It's an amazingly versatile steering wheel compatible with most consoles and PC out at the moment. It is a X input and direct input wheel, meaning that it utilizes the form of communication that is used in the standard racing titles, but it also uses X input, which is what your box standard um, Xbox controller uses, meaning that when you essentially plug this thing in straight out of the box, it's going to act like an Xbox controller and be ready to go with games such as GTA 5. It also means that you can make custom configurations for games that support Xbox controllers. So to make this video as quickly as possible, I thought I'd get straight to the fun part in showing off the wheel of one of my favourite cars in GTA. Now I was amazed when I plugged this straight in and it literally just started working with GTA. I had spent the past two or three days faffing about with Xbox 360 CE and um, managed to get it actually running but I had no idea that X input meant that the controller is essentially an Xbox compatible controller which means that it shows up and runs like an Xbox controller in pretty much any game which means that you're going to be able to go straight into games from boxed and um, set up your own custom controls, set up um, things with the actual in-game functionality that the games will give you to be able to edit the Xbox controller. Now, they could have given you a bit more of a extensive driver solution. I kind of think that the options that the driver utility gives you don't really seem to be don't seem to be as um, significant as I've had when, say, I bought my um, Thrustmaster Hotas. But uh, the way the control actually functions initially means that it's very plug and play, very user friendly. And I think it is the essentially utility of this that makes it worth buying ahead of something more expensive that has force feedback. Because although force feedback is an amazing feature, I don't actually believe that for games as simple as GTA and for games as simple as with simple physics like Star Citizen, which this will work with perfectly, um, I don't really believe that force feedback is something that's going to be necessary for some time anyway, in Star Citizen's terms specifically because that game has very very basic um, physics when it comes to driving but hella fun hella fun with the steering wheel so i'd suggest you try this out um this wheel is incredible value for money it's incredibly well built it's incredibly um just nice ergonomically it clips to the desk really easily and really simply and I can't say enough good things about it for the price, which was £130 for me in 2022 in the UK. So hopefully, if anyone is looking for a way to play basic driving games with a little bit more immersion, a little bit more style, a little bit more fun, basically, then this is the one for you. I would not suggest looking at the Hori Racing Wheel or any of the other cheap alternatives out there because they don't come with the basic vibration that this comes with, which simulates controller vibration, which is perfect. 
it's able to switch to direct input mode so you can play all of your favorite standard racing games with force feedback style controller vibration as well but um, I think this thing really shines at the fact that it is compatible with just about everything and for a cheap price it will essentially emulate an Xbox controller straight out of the box what more can you ask for if this video was helpful to you um, yeah like and subscribe and all that good stuff thanks